All right, guys, welcome back. This is our uh, old-fashioned mead. This is a progress uh, report on it. If you look on the side, look how that thing is fermenting. Yeah, buddy, that's doing good. And this is the airlock. See, that's what the airlock's supposed to do. It's like the P-trap on your sink. It lets the CO2 come out, but it lets the buggies and other things that could get in there stay in there. So one thing I forgot to do um, and I, I want this to taste like an old-fashioned, obviously. So one thing I want to do is I want to add some tannin to it. Since I'm, we're not going to oak this, I might oak a jar, uh, not a jar, a, a, a bottle of it. But I don't know. What, but what I want to do is I want to put some wine tannins in it. So basically what this is, is just, I think it's just crushed, crushed up uh, walnuts? Chestnuts. Crushed up chestnuts. And so uh, it acts as tannin like you would have if you were to oak age something. So what I'm gonna do, if I can precariously do this, now let's take the lid off real fast. Now this is totally fine to do since it's actively fermenting, right? Let me just set that to the side real fast. And I'm gonna use half a teaspoon. Let's see if I can get in there. There we are, half a teaspoon right on top. Okay, there we go. Pay no mind to all my mess in here. <laughs> this is the shed, that's what it's used for. And I try and clean it up, but it's always gets in the way. All right, so what I'm gonna do, set this down so I don't spill it. Um, I'm just gonna give it a little swirl. Let all that chestnut stuff get in there and look how it's foaming up. It's got a lot of CO2 in it. That's awesome. That means it's a very healthy and active fermentation. Let's go down to the bottom. You can't see any le any croissant, anything. You can see the little uh, orange orange peels floating around in it and stuff. It's really, really cool looking. So, all right, that's your update. It's going good. This is about day two. Um, I had to turn the heat on in here. It was a little cool in the shed, so I turned the heat on. Um, which I don't mind doing uh, during this because it uh, keeps this ferment going. So, all right. Thank you all. Have a good one. We'll have another update soon.